Do you want to drive your veterinarian crazy? I'm Dr. Andy Rourke, and here are my top five tips on how to do it. Number five, no matter what, it's an emergency. I'm in the stretcher. I have an emergency. My dog has an ear infection. You're gonna have to wait. Where's that stretcher? Number four, the best time to be seen is closing time. I'm so glad I caught you. Uh, yeah, I was just getting ready to close up. Um, I would have been here earlier. I was watching the Matlock Marathon. Ah, I was, I was just about to lock the door. Perfect. Thank you. Number three. No matter what, answer your phone. I'm afraid I have some, uh, some bad news about George. Hold on just one second. Hey. Oh, no, I'm, I'm not doing anything. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> okay, all right, yeah. I'll call you in a little bit. All right, all right, bye, girl. Number two. Have the doctor talk to everyone you know. Okay. Who's in charge here? So, my friend Sarah really loves this cat. Can you email her the results? I'm gonna need a detailed financial summary. Oh, I'm gonna need you to email my pet sitter a prescription summary. I got grandma on speakerphone. Hi, Hi grandma. grandma! So, you are gonna be getting a call from the cat psychic as well. Instagram! Number one, don't do anything the vet recommends and tell him. Do you have any questions? Nope. So you're going to give the medications as directed? Not a chance. Why not? Do you have any? Too much effort. Really? Yeah. So you're just not going, not going to give them? Nope. 